morning from Race Day here in Monza. Lance with me um, here on a sort of cloudy Sunday morning, isn't it? It's the, the forecast has been weird all weekend. They keep talking about rain and then didn't come. Then they said it was going to be sunny and it rained. It's been all over the place. Let's do a rain dance. Yeah. <laughs> um, we can you should some be rain this afternoon. Yeah, you should be Mixing pleased with qualifying. Up. Very pleased, very pleased. Yeah, it was... Uh, it was great getting into Q3. Uh, yeah, it was unexpected, but uh, very, very pleasant surprise. I mean, qualifying was tricky, isn't it? Because around here, the slipstream effect is huge. And may maybe explain to people at home just what you've got to do in the cockpit, because you could see everybody around the paddock just trying to judge where to, to leave the pits and yeah. where to get in the train and who to follow and how to follow, how close, you know, just Maybe explain that a little bit. Yeah, for sure. Well, you know, it's one of those tracks, very unique um, uh, track because there's so much lap time uh, in, in the slipstream. So uh, all, all the drivers are trying to get behind, you know, an, uh, uh, another car between two and a half, three and a half seconds um, to gain that performance down the straight and to, to get that toe. Um, which is which is uh, which is very unique because normally we want to be in, in clean air and far away from all the other cars. So, so, so we normally get, you want to be what five seconds? Even more, I'd say normally a seven eight seconds. You know to 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 um, to get the best performance from the aerodynamics because obviously um, you know uh, with with the slipstream comes a poor comes poor performance in the corners. So um, there's a bit of a trade off, but around here. The straights are so long. What you lose in the corners is nothing com compared to what uh, what's gained on the straights. So uh, we we definitely did a good job yesterday, uh, strategizing our qualifying around that. Um, you know, we were always uh, in, in the right place at the right time, um, except for Q1. Q1 was 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 bad. We were all by, all by ourselves, and uh, we just had to wing it. But um, we just just scraped through, and then uh, Q2, Q3, yeah, we. Uh, we got a great slipstream, great toe down the straights, um, and then you know uh, my my corners were tidy, and uh, yeah, the lap time came to us, and you know uh, we're in the mix today, which is nice. I mean, you obviously like it round here. You raced with an Italian team in F3, so I'm guessing you've done quite a bit of mileage round here. It, it, it is a mega track, isn't it? It is. Um, it's never actually been uh, a place uh, I like coming to in the junior formulas um, because without the power of a Formula One car. The straights are just just too long. Um, so Formula Three, Formula Four, it wasn't really uh, my my favorite place. Um, but yeah, I've had uh, a couple couple highlights in Formula One around here, and uh, yeah, hopefully a, a good race this afternoon. And finally, let's talk about the first lap because it's always tricky into that first chicane, isn't it? It sort of all funnels down and. I mean, I'm guessing. I wouldn't know. I was uh, up at the front. <laughs> you were up last at the year. front. Yeah, it's true. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm guessing one of the first things is how do you get through with front wing intact and all of that on lap one, isn't it? Yeah, it's definitely going to be different uh, to, to, to last year. Um, morning, Hello. Sir. I'm stealing your thunder. Well, not really stealing your thunder. I'm standing out there waiting. Spotlight's all is yours. it my turn? Spotlight's all yours. Well, you quickly finish that I'm answer. Finishing up. What was, so what was the question? First, co first, first lap. Corner, What's first your lap. plan on lap one? Because you're um, normally good on lap one. Yeah, just you know, uh, send it, send it down the inside, and uh, yeah, not cross crash. my fingers. Not yeah, just gain five positions yeah. and not crash. Pretty yeah. straightforward. Get in a podium paying place. Back Very good. Two. That's yeah. it. Very good. All right, you can. Yeah, easier over. said than done. <laughs> <laughs> all right, thanks, right, Lance. Good luck for today. Claire, your drivers are Sorry, in a that much... Sorry, very rude. I no. interrupted. That's fine. Buongiorno. Um, Yo, buongiorno. Buongiorno. Come stai? Tutto posto? Molto bene. Si, Grazie. No. Fantastic. We Fancy are... my Italiano. Yeah. Uh, you got the hand <laughs> gestures and everything. Yeah, yeah, that's, yeah I shouldn't do that. <laughs> no, that's probably no. not. <laughs> um, your drivers are in a much better mood, as are you this morning. Yeah, that's true, actually. Yesterday felt quite nice, and I think everybody really deserved it. Um, it didn't feel like a fluke. It felt certainly like... Um, the result of lots of hard work that's been going on um, and it was just a great morale boost we really needed it although you know you watch it and you think oh should I really be celebrating p10 and 12 but hey you've got to take those moments and enjoy them I'm not sure how the race is going to be today I have to wait and see yeah as you say we'll, we'll wait and see I mean so far it looks like it's going to be a dry race it's a few clouds around but the forecast is yeah. a little bit better. Yep. Um, I mean, Monza is one of those mega races to come to, isn't it? When you look down at the 
paddock, it's bustling, it's yeah, busy, it's, it's, it's just a great venue to come to, isn't it? We were saying, well, I was saying in the van coming in this morning, you come into this circuit and it's just filled. I mean, most of the guys are wearing Ferrari shirts, but hey, we won't worry too much about that. So they should be. Um, but you just can't get in for the people. But actually, at every European round that we've been to this year, I've never seen more people, more fans come out and see us. And it's just, it kind of makes your heart sore a little bit because it's so nice to... You know, fine, they may not be coming to see us, but just the fact that Formula One seems to be growing in its popularity, that can only be a great thing for everybody that you know, competes in this sport. Now, let's, let's talk about, you know, you, you mentioned your emotions yesterday. It was relief that you, you guys have delivered a, a result, I think, after, uh, you know, it's been a tough season, but it's, it's come together. Yeah. What, what, did, what did you do last night? I mean, did you sit down with Paddy Lowe and go, hang on a second, we've had a good result here. How do we build on this? Or was it just a... Let's just deal with tomorrow and then sort it out in the week. Not really, because it's my husband's birthday today. So we went out for dinner. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> and we, Paddy was there, um, but we banned all, all work chat. We weren't allowed to do it. So um, I, I don't know what, you know what the score is. I do. Of course I do. Um, I do genuinely believe that this is the culmination of some hard work. And we always said that, you know. I think if anyone thought we were just going to make no progress, that's unrealistic because we've got 700 people working at Grove making sure that we do bring performance to the car. But in, it'll always go into, it was always going to be in a gradual way. So I do think this is the result of that. And we've just got to keep doing this at every race. But it certainly feels a little bit better making that progress finding. I just hope we've turned a corner. Everyone deserves it at Williams. Right. Fingers crossed for today. Your other drivers just come up. Sergei's so coming in, is we'll, he? Uh, we'll, we'll wheel him in. Come on in. All right. All right, Claire, if you can... Uh, Arrivederci. 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 <laughs> you're, you're on. <laughs> how are you doing? Good to see you. Um, Sergei, how was qualifying for you? Were you pleased with what happened uh, yesterday? Uh, I mean, I think you followed enough to see that I was really not happy with what happened. Uh, when we analyzed everything, uh, Basically, it was uh, my confusion with a uh, with a couple of switches uh, which are working on a little bit different system. So some of them are, let me say, more automatic, uh, which we usually use, and some of them, uh, the one I was using yesterday for quality was more manual, which is not the usual system we are working. So I was forgetting uh, to bring them back in the you know in the optimal window uh, for the each single you know, further lap in the quality. So, yeah, it was just falling apart. Face. Sorry, it's a bee in my face. Carry on. <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought. It was just falling apart through the through the quality further and further. Uh, obviously, to correct that, to help these issues, we're changing some other mechanical things in the car, but obviously, you know, you kind of unproposedly made uh, something bad then trying to sort it uh, in these areas you damaged mechanically other, other yeah. things, so it's been like... So, so in terms of the race, I mean, you're still in the mix. You you know, you're not far away from the points. Um, you know, presumably that's got to be the target today is have a good, clean first lap as Jacques, our cameraman, nearly fell off the balcony here. <laughs> uh, <I'm> excited. <laughs> yeah, that, w that would not have been funny. <laughs> uh, but, yeah, is, uh, you know, target's got to be points today? Points, that's a good, another point, points. Uh, need to be sure about that, yeah. I mean, as I say, uh, even if I think it, it was a lot more to, to come and gain through yesterday quality, uh, I think we shouldn't be too upset because realistically it could be, I would say eight probably would be the maximum. I could be, I mean, according to all the pace calculations, I could think we could be. So it's just like two rows ahead. I mean, but I still have the tire choice and you know, nailing the first lap, you are there. So it changed not that much for the race. It's a long race with a lot of slipstream and a lot of fights here. So, I mean, uh, yeah, for sure. I mean, we're we're not we're not upset either. All right, um, I'll leave you to get ready for the race. We haven't got long to go for the drivers' parade, I guess. Uh, good luck, and we Thank will you. we will Thank see you. you all from the paddock in Singapore.